Good morning traders. Richard here doing a quick Ichimoku cloud chart market review of the Xetra DAX index. Uh, last couple of weeks we had a fantastic rebound from all cloud chart support levels. There's a whole cluster of support here. Previous lows and top end cloud chart support levels as well as bottom end cloud chart support levels. Then the DAX managed to break through the bottom in the cloud only to run into resistance of old cloud chart resistance zones, previous support zones, which are now resistance zones. You can see that zone very closely it reversed lower after hitting the uh, that 14, uh, well, 15,000 basically just below the 15,000 resistance zone. Sold off, then sliced through the bottom in the cloud. Now we're back in bearish territory on the daily and the weekly. Sorry, the weekly year, and uh, so there's significant downside risk now because price action below the bottom end of the cloud is overall bearish. You can also see the front end of the cloud indicating that we might still see some more downside. Uh, the thing now is we can see short-term relief rally back up to the bottom end of the cloud as it's going to hit these resistance zones and also the front end of the cloud, that resistance zone there. So these are the two res upside resistance zones to look for. Support zone on the... Uh, uh, weekly one is this bottom in cloud chart support zone. So we did get a rebound from that uh, zone. Very tight training range now because uh, we've got this support zone and we're very close to the upside resistance zones. But do remember, we really need to be back above the top end of the cloud here to be bullish on the weekly. Plenty of sell signals at the top end of the cloud here on the DAX. So any trades now are just swing trades. Long term, long term sell signals remain in place. If we look at the daily, you can see this cluster of rebound here back up to the bottom end of the cloud, then corrected, then tried to rebound from the front end cloud chart support zone, but now he's trading below the cloud. So the bearish outlook is once again on the daily. We have a bearish outlook on the daily. We really need to cross this cloud and price action needs to trade back above the top end of the cloud yet to be bullish on the daily. So we're not out the woods yet, uh, but the DAX is now in a stuck in a narrow trading range with support uh, zones, this uh, bottom end cloud chart support zones, this cluster of support there, upside resistance zones is this old uh, 14, uh, 369 upside resistance zones on the daily. Turning to the four hour chart, you can see how we did a nice couple of swing trades, which is mainly range bound from old cloud chart support levels and old cloud chart resistance zones. Yeah, we got our rebound from this old cloud chart support levels we get from the daily back above the bottom in the cloud. Yeah, you can see how that uh, bottom in cloud chart of 14.2 resistance came into play. So we really need to see a breakout past these uh, uh, resistance zones. And you can see the front end cloud chart resistance zone. So these are two upside resistance zones. Now price action below the cloud is bearish. So the four hour chart is still bearish with upside resistance targets. The bottom end of the cloud, yeah, we can see reversal when we hit those resistance targets. But ideally we'd like to see a breakout past this cloud chart resistance to change the outlook back to bullish. Price action below the cloud is bearish. Price action above the cloud is bullish from an Ichimoku cloud chart perspective. So these are the levels to watch out for upside resistance with uh, key support zones for potential rebounds. Until next time, happy cloud chart trading. Bye for now.